December 20th, 2018. A young up-and-coming Mr. Red lays his eyes upon his screen for the, I believe, third time to play a video game on his channel, Mr. Red Plays. That game? Bendy and the Ink Machine. I had a lot of fun with it. It was a great game. Uh, and now, today, we sit down to, for the two billionth time, it feels like, to play yet another game. Bendy and the Dark Revival. That's right, boys! It's a squeakquel! Uh, we have been uh, excited about this for a while. I actually didn't know that this game was coming out, so when I say excited about this for a while, what I mean is heard about it recently and want to play it. So here we go. Joey Juice Studios presents. Now, we of course remember everything that happened We're in the first game. We're always free to choose. We're always free to choose. That's another to given. believe what we want to believe. Mm hmm But when you step back... I won't. When you really stand look right here. at where you've been. Is this the house from the first the game? You've done. It looks like it. I remember that kitchen. Your past will come. To devour you. Uh, I don't want that to happen. Uh, so yeah, like I said, we of course remember what happened in the last game, so we won't have any issues when it comes to playing this one and not knowing what's going on, or who the characters are, or anything. So, this should be fun. Okay, we're an artist. Wait, did it, um, because the other, what, when did the other game take place is the question, because I remember we were visiting this studio, which is obviously very like, there you go, a 20s, bit. 30s inspired animation. To go. No oh way boy. I'm getting through tonight without some coffee. Oh, Probably you're telling me. Downstairs. Oh, okay. Oh. Time for a little adventure. Cool. I'm me. I'm Audrey. Oh, I was the one talking just then. Okay, cool. Uh, what's 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 that? What's that say? What's on my to what's on my to-do list? Can I zoom in on that? I can't really see what that says. I'm gonna have to switch to keyboard and mouse here. Oh jeez, that is some low sensitivity. Alright, so we remember Boris. We remember Bendy. We remember Alice Angel. So I think we're gonna be okay. Uh, I have some storyboards. I'm trying to see what is going on here. There's a toaster. It's too far away for me to see. All right, fine. Uh, we're gonna go find some coffee. My favorite part of every video game is when we go to find some coffee. Well, here's some soda. That's got caffeine in it. Root beer. MF, MT, MT, seven new, spritz, that one's broken, cola, all right, cool. Oh, that's a spooky little poster over there. Okay. Okay, why am I turning around? Why am I turning around? Oh, God, I hate when we turn around. What? Archgate Pictures? What? That's not what it was before. It was Joey Drew Studios. Did this door open just now? Did I close this when I came through? Or is everything fine? Is everything cool? Oh, that's... What? That's terrifying. Oh, God. That's very scary. Why would they have that? <gasps> I have a reflection. Hello, Audrey. This is cool. This is not easy to do to make a reflection in a video game. So I, have to, I always admire that. Oh, what's this? What's this? Alice Angel poses and such. Is she Jesus? She has a hole in her hand. That's like that stigmata thing. She's Jesus. Oh, because she's an angel. Oh, that's cool, actually. I thought I was making a stupid joke, and I was, but I was more right than I believed. All right, let's go through and get some coffee. Really? They what? locked me in. They locked me in. Good thing I brought my own key today. Oh, okay. Retrieve your office keys. Do I have to go back to my office? Why? Oh, take out menu for what? Uncle Sal's Pizzeria. Uh-oh. A pizzeria in a horror game? That's never going to be good. What's this? Ooh, is there a date on this? Episode 12. The escape? The bear pie? Bear pie. What's that say? So sass. Sass. That looks like S-A. I can't read the rest. All right, I just want to read everything. I just want the lore. That looks like Bendy. 
Shit! Was that a gunshot? Jesus. If that was supposed to be a thunder! Fucking God. Alright, this... this here. Yeah, I, I don't... Bendy the demon! Oh, was he the demon before? I mean, he does have horns. Oh God, I'm I'm on a, I'm on edge already. Whew. When will I get my axe? When will I get my axe? Remember, there was an axe in the other game, or a flashlight, so I can see everything. Oh. Whew. Here's the key. All right, I'm gonna turn. Jesus Christ! Oh, and he's gone. He's gone. Good. That's what I was hoping for, that he wouldn't be there anymore. I mean, kind of, yeah, but also not really. Okay, here we go. I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Okay. Uh, most welcoming hallway I've ever seen. Um. Did you see that? Did you see that move, lady? Audrey? You're not at all concerned. The store's Hello? open. Is someone there? Stop. Stop! Is someone there? <laughs> I want to know. I search. What's in here? What? 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 Nothing. Then why have me open it then? Oh, search. Nothing. Oh my God, that's frustrating. Okay. Um, this thing moved. Is someone over? Here? Is that what I was saying? Hello to? Is someone there? Because is someone there? I want to know. Oh, they have a fire in here. I don't want to go. I don't want to go in there. There's a fire. This door's open. I want to go inside. I don't know what's going on down there. I just got to go. I'm scaring. I'm scaring myself. Here we go. This is an old elevator. Duh. God in heaven. Okay. Well, down we go. I don't know what floor I need to get to. Uh, First floor? Yeah. Yep, I knew it. Oh God, I knew it. Oh Jesus. You scared me to death. What's up with your eye? I'm sorry, my dear. Does he have a glass eye? Didn't or is something scary happening? You. You're working late tonight. Yeah. A pretty girl like you. Oh, don't do that. Shouldn't be wandering around all by yourself. Yeah, because there's my freaks father. like you. Step in. No. I mean, yes. Oh, of course not. <laughs> I do mind. You Damn it! I accidentally oh, invited him in, like a weird vampire. You look like you could use a little company. Yeah, this isn't gonna be good. I, 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 I don't like this guy. Oh, and he's coughing. Jesus, I'm triggered. It's been really nice this past week. Oh, that's Just good. Beautiful. What am I looking down for? Oh, stop. Stop. Oh, no. What was that? Please tell me we're not trapped in here. Don't you worry, my dear. This is a problem. It's just a little short in this system. Okay. I'm getting a little short with you. That's what's happening. No need to fret. Okay. Are we where we need to be? What's going on? Let's see what we can find. What are you talking about? Let's see what we can find. Old Wilson will protect you. Yeah. Uh, did we stop here? Is that what I'm gathering? What floor are we on right now? Does it say? Get out of here, Old Wilson. Oh, Jesus. Ugh. Gross. Yeah, turn some lights on, will ya? Anytime. Whenever you're ready, Wilson. Waiting on you now. Can't really see much of anything, so I was hoping he would... Turn those lights on, but he doesn't seem to be doing that. So I'm wondering if I just need to go forward and hope nothing terrible is in here. I'll look behind me. Oh, I, I I didn't move. Oh, I can't move. I can't go forward. <laughs> well, that explains that. Oh, press E to talk. Of course. Whoa, whoa. Uh, there we are. Okay, just good. A few more switches to throw. Follow me. What? You can't do them from here? Safe. Uh, sure, okay, fine. I still don't know what floor we're on. Can't we take the stairs? We met him, didn't we? Old old Joey Drew. 
The man and the demon. Arch picture, Archgate Pictures presents. Oh, here we go. 1901 to 1971. Hey, he was seven years old. Joey Drew was the founder of the studio and the man who created Bendy, one of the most beloved cartoon characters of all time. In 1929, with the help of his business partner, Henry Stein, he created Bendy's first short film, Little Devil Darwin, as an early talky cartoon. As his entertainment legacy grew over the years, Joey's optimism and pioneering spirit never wavered. Starting with just a pencil and a dream, he created this studio. Here at Arcade Pictures, we strive to continue his dream and see Bendy live on. So, why am I drawing in such an old animation style? Is it because... We're trying to like continue the Bendy uh, 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 franchise, but like you don't use the same animation methods typically. Ooh, Bendy sing along. Yeah, and it could be one of those things, you know. Ooh, Boris, Boris, my friend Boris and his banjo. Silly vision. Silly Vision is a cartoon format developed by Joey Drew that allowed for animated cartoons to be completed more efficiently by streamlining the pencil and digging stages and allowing for last-minute adjustments to be made directly on the film stock itself. The film was chemically coated to allow for a specially formulated ink to be applied by an artist working on a magnifying table. This allowed for adjustments, action enhancements, or even a new whole new character to be added after the cartoon had been photographed. Mr. Drew intended for the format to be used someday to create interactive experiences where the cartoons could be custom-altered to fit the occasion or audience. Fascinating. Ah! Art! I love art. Um, but I don't know. It's hard to say. What do you got to say for yourself? Hey, I said talk, not turn your back on me. Hey, come back here, Wilson. Fine. The Dancing Demon by Bond. See, this is old. This is like 40s old. Oh. Oh. We have a wrench on a thing that says flow. Cool. Looks now like what do you have to say for yourself? Messing with the exhibits. You? There should be something on each of these pedestals. Oh, Jesus, I remember this. Audrey. Sweet Audrey. Okay, stop. Do Just old man a favor stop. And go find them. Yeah, anything to get away from I'll you. Tend to the power. All right. Sounds good. Can't be upset about that. All right. Oh, I could take... I will take, and I shall take. There we go. Hell yeah. Can I swing this? I like to believe that I could swing this. Let's try it. No, none of these are doing anything. Wait, what do we need to go find? Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, I, I do remember this. This was we, we did this last time. So it looks like a bendy doll, a music, which I'm guessing is going to be like a uh, uh, record, uh, some ink. Is this the exact same stuff from the first one too? A cog? Oh, a wrench. Oh, I have that. Okay. And what's that? A bell? I can't rightly see what that is. But I have this wrench, which I guess is not a weapon. It is instead a wrench. And who? by the way, who cares? By the way, who cares about this? Why, like, why are you making me do this? This does not impact your uh, whatever it is you're doing. Oh, here's a bendy doll. I didn't notice this before. I'm hoping it was here before and I just didn't notice it. Well, that was a cool depth of field change, too. Uh, so there's wall. I mean, uh, Joey, <laughs> Joey Drew. <laughs> um, yep. So these are old pictures from obviously pre-1970 because he was dead. Can I pick up other stuff while we're here? If there is even anything to find. Do I have to do one thing at a time? Oh, the record. Yeah, the record. So I can take this. Nice. Pick it up by the side so you don't get any of the uh, any of the grooves all, all, all grooved out. I want to take this banjo is what I really want. Okay, so we got ourselves a bendy doll. Let's go ahead and place that down there. A musical disc. There we go. Well, that cool. It made a sound like a record. So I still need ink, which is probably back at my office. Wait, no, that was in the elevator. I can't get there. A cog. Not sure why it just paused on me like that. That's fine, though. Well, I'll save the game. For some reason, I... It paused, and I can't uh, can't get out of the pause screen. Hmm. It seems to have completely frozen up while I'm saving, so I don't know if it is saving or not. I need to probably end this game and then launch it again. This is a very uh, Arkham-esque uh, opening sequence, like Arkham City, like Arkham Knight. 
like Arkham Origin. No, not that one. All right, let's continue and see where we uh, end up. It could literally be anywhere, honestly. Oh, I got the bendy. Uh, 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 okay, okay. We're, we're just back here. That's fine. By the way, why is there no sprint button? Why is there no a sprint button? Okay, so I need ink, cog, and whatever the hell that is. And I know I can't get back to my desk, so there must be ink right here. Hell yeah! Oh. Mm, 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 mm. I don't like that. I don't like why the camera looked up like that. What's this? Man, I wish I had a flashlight. Is that a watch? Can I take that? Can I steal your watch, Joey? You don't need it anymore. And by the way, uh, this is the elevator. This is where the fuse box was. Why is there no fuse box here anymore? That's concerning. I'm concerned about that. I, 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 I would imagine that's where a cog would be if I were to find a cog. I don't know much about cogs, but I do know that, that you'd probably find them in a fuse box. There's probably a cog in a typewriter. Open that up. Let's check it out. Let's bust that thing open. See what there is to see. Well, I got ink, so I can at least put that down. Um, so cog and what on earth is that? It might be a lamp. Could be a lamp. I'm going to say it's a lamp. Is there a cog in this thing? There sh should be. There should be a cog in this thing. It's a machine. It's an ink machine. Wilson... I need some help. Wilson. Wilson. You're not doing anything, Wilson. I know that. You're not fooling anyone. Now, it's entirely likely that uh, the answer to what I'm looking for is right in front of my face, and I wouldn't have any idea. Well, can I just take this? Is this not going to be a problem for anyone? Do you not need this cog in there, or is this just a cog box? It just holds cogs. Don't worry, Wilson. I found the cog box. Don't worry about it. Oh, that's a heavy cog. It's a hefty cog. Okay, so I need what? A, la a lamp? A lantern? Guess so. There's tons in these things. They're all lit up. Look right there. Give me that one. What's this flashing red? And nothing else around here. Like, look, everything else is beautifully and perfectly lit. In fact, it's lit fam. But except for that one that's flashing red. So assuming that I'm right about it being a lamp, slash lantern of some sort, then I'm S-O-L because I don't know that there is any anywhere. Those are some weird looking electrical outlets. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Hello now. Maybe it was a book. Maybe it was a book. Could it have been a book? Might it be a book? Yes, it is a book. All right. That was my fault. Okay, book found. Well, there was tons of books out there then. Why was that one so special? Oh, you're done now, Wilson. Jesus Christ. All right, all right. Enough of that now. Thing left to do. What's oh, that, Wilson? Switch. I'm not turning my back on you, Wilson. I'm going to do it looking at you. Don't mind me. I'm just going to do it looking at you. There we go. Oh, I turned my back on him. This is worse! No! Wilson? Oh, Audrey. Oh, no. The things you've set in motion. Oops. The ink is calling us, my dear. Okay, I'm gonna go. Can't you hear it? Nope. Nope. Don't fret. We're going home. Stay back. What? Pay attention Ooh. to these last words. Uh. Because very soon you will forget everything. Let what? go. What? Come find me, Audrey. What? Come find me, and I'll show you your purpose. What are you saying right now? I'll show you the truth. Don't. What? Oh, no. What? No. Huh. 
Yeah, we're under think. Okay, so he was saying to uh, listen to his words, but then he didn't say anything other than like, you're going to forget everything, and then we're going to die, and then come find me. So are we dying, or am I coming to find you? Oh, there we go. Bending the Dark Revival. Cool. Title card. Awesome. All right. Well, I'm intrigued. I want to know when the game is taking place. I want to know what the hell is going on. These are all very good questions that I have. So we'll see what we can find. But we'll do it in the next episode. Thank you so much for watching. Tune in shortly for more Bendy and The Dark Revival. Uh, I'm going to do, not in the next episode I'm going to do it. Uh, I think I'm going to save it because I don't think this is like a new game. It is a new game, but everyone else has already played it. So you're not coming to Mr. Red Plays for... Uh, exciting bendy ventures just yet. Um, no, in fact, I'm going to do something else. I'm going to go back to an old favorite, something that I played in the past, but there's new discoveries in store. So, uh, Tori 3D. We're going to play Tori 3D, but there's more to it. So, tune in for that. It's going to be very exciting. Uh, until then, I'm going to Mr. Red. Stay spooky out there, everybody. And remember, keep watching. Thank you.